Hello there, I'm Lucas, the doofus that runs this art channel, and today I kind of have a more special video planned. I'm showing off the process of um, my first Genshin OC's birthday art. His name is Wolfier. He is a Pyro Catalyst user from Liyue. Um, he's a treasure hoarder and, you know, I've had him for, since March of 2021, <laughs> which is, uh, crazy, cause that's only a few months after I actually started playing Genshin Impact, which was in November of 2020. Um... So I've had him for nearly as long as I've been playing, and I'm gonna be real, I don't even like this game. Like I do, but like, <laughs> um, it got boring after a while. I think I started getting burnt out um, during the Inazuma arc, because I don't know what it was about Inazuma that just was so, so boring they did not do that story right but if you like inazuma that's totally your opinion and i'm fine with that um however i did love sumeru and i adore fontaine fontaine has only been here for like a couple weeks by now and um right now i'm building Fremine because he's voiced by Paul Castro Jr., who voices Rindo in Neo The World Ends With You, which is such a amazing game, and I adore it, but I'm getting sidetracked. Um, with this art, this piece, um, I had the idea to make it, like, official Hoyoverse, um birthday art post sort of thing, you know, I, I, whatever. So I had that idea, right, um, where I would make a full drawing in the style, kind of, kind of in the style, of, like, official Hoyoverse birthday art. Like, of course, it being my own art style, but, like, um, what's it called? Composition-wise. There we go. That's the word. Composition-wise. As well as lighting and, you know, location, subject matter. Uh, as well as making my signature rather than what it usually is. Um, kind of mimic the Genshin Impact logo. <laughs> um, yeah, and when I post it, um, on his birthday, which is coincidentally the day that this video is going up, September 9th, um, when I post it, I'm going to format the post, like, how Hoyoverse formats their Instagram birthday posts. Except I didn't do a chibi um, photo because it is way too hard to draw on that chibi style. I am sorry. I am not doing that to myself. But um, yeah, so just the caption is going to be, Happy birthday, Wolfier! And then a little like paragraph or two of just Wolfier talking, which is going to be hard for me because like, I know how this dude talks, but like, how is he gonna talk about his birthday, you know? Um, and then two whole hashtags. Two of them. <laughs> um, but then I'm going to make a separate post for zoom ins and other birthday art that I've made um, for him with all of his friends 
which are my other Genshin OCs. I have like six of them. I've told you guys this, that I have six of them. Volpir was the first. Um, then in order, it's Enoch, Elfie, Peter, Dimitri, and Klaus. So I have four boys, two girls, and all of them are my favorites. <laughs> um, yeah, I just, I had a lot of fun drawing this. Um, it took way less time than I thought it would take me because I had like such a huge like passion and excitement for this specific piece. Um, I originally wasn't even meaning to make a video about it, but like after I did the original composition sketch, I was like, yeah, this would be, this would be a pretty fun video if I were to just talk about it. And so I started recording with the Procreate, um, what's it called? Like, time-lapse function? Uh, so I exported the video and it was like 17 minutes long. So I, like, sped it up to 10 minutes long, um, which is still a bit much, but I kind of wanted time to talk. Uh, yeah, I, <laughs> I mean, I got this piece done in three days when usually if my heart's not in it, it would take me like a week to finish something like this. But I was so excited because I love Volfir and I used to like hate him. Not like hate hate him, but like the same way that I hate like child uh, Tartaglia where I love every single piece of art that comes across of this character. But and I love him in the game, but if I ever, <laughs> if I ever openly admit that I love this character, I, my reputation will be ruined. That sort of feeling. When in reality, that's not true. <laughs> um, but yeah, uh. Then I just openly admitted, you know what, I love Volfir. And since then, Volfir has just been like the cutest guy to me. Every single like um, drawing that I did of him with each of his friends, he just has this massive goofy smile. And it just, it feels good to know that this fictional character one that isn't even in the game means so much to me and so much to my friends. Like, they all love Wolfier too, and it, it feels nice. And drawing him very happy like this, I don't know, it like heals something in me. Something in the water, I guess. <laughs> but I hope you liked watching this even though I barely even talked about my process. Um, by the way, I freehanded that entire squirrel fish. I just drew, like, sketched in the lumps, and within the line art, I just, I freehanded it, and it looked so awesome. And this was the first time I've ever, like, uh, rendered in food. I just, uh, looked at like Studio Ghibli food and just kind of mimicked what I saw. <laughs> um, also, I drew in nearly that in- I drew in that stupid background and Volker was covering up like a hundred percent of it. <laughs> I drew in the mountain ranges and all that and Volker was covering it all up and I knew it. I knew it was gonna come out that way. Whatever. Um, I hoped you enjoyed watching this process once again. Um, thank you for taking this time to celebrate 
his birthday with me, even if we were watching for like not that much time. Whatever. I don't. I don't really care actually. But yeah, don't forget to stretch and have a wonderful day or night. Bye bye. The Insane Clown Posse. That's right. Sarah. ICP. Ice Cold People.